think so. Bob was pulling out all the stops, you know, and um, yeah, God bless him. Yeah, he just maneuvered everybody into place, but it was for the the right reasons. Yeah, yeah, he was doing similar things to us, ringing us up and saying, "You got to do it. You got to do it. You can't wake up the next morning and etc. Cetera, etc." Cetera. And um, you got to be with us, etc. Um, yeah, Live Aid stirs up memories, of course, for me with Quo because we sat in the in the royal box with. Charles and Diana and Bob Geldof and David Bowie and a few other people and watched Quo open the whole day doing rocking all over the world uh, and I've still got pictures of it uh, and it was a great moment it really was an amazing moment because Geldof had pulled it off and there was the audience packed and this thing was actually happening and as we know the money actually did get to Africa and we all felt very um, proud to be part of that it was a unique moment in time live aid i don't think there's ever been anything quite like that yeah, yeah there was a there's supposed to be a rigid system to keep to keep it to time to make it run to time which is common which is a common thing um i actually wasn't aware of it me and my naivety or whatever i was just in my own world and i don't remember seeing any traffic lights i just remember it's like plan the dive and dive the plan you know I was just I knew what we were doing I just had my head in it and I knew how long it lasted I had confidence um, and we just played what we'd planned yeah. um, I think it was perfect it was perfect yeah and it's true there wasn't any jockeying for position as I remember it nobody was saying oh I have to go on last or I have to have this spot of it everybody just did what Bob wanted them to do um, and there was a complete lack of this sort of ego stuff that usually goes on at events like that. No, everybody was great. Everyone was cool and just had a very nice day and kind of wheeled out the hits. That's what Bob said. Bob said, play the hits. It's a global jukebox. Uh, don't get clever. You know? and, and it was very good advice because people who did sort of play their latest hit didn't connect very well, obviously, because you don't. You know, it's, it's not, a, not a place to be doing that. But people who, like us just put together their biggest, most well-known tracks, and quo, you know, just got into the mood of it and it worked.